Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I am going to be doing a Target Fall Haul. The reason why I'm calling it a Target Fall Haul is because I have a lot of things that are fall related but I also have other things that I kind of purchased that I'm just going to throw that into today's video just to kind of show you guys what I picked up at Target. So if you guys are interested in this type of video and you guys would love to see what I picked up at Target then please continue watching. So the first thing I want to show you guys are my pumpkins. Ah, I'm so in love with this pumpkin right now. <laughs> oh my god, I need to get it together. This pumpkin, you guys, was five dollars. At first, I was like, I'm not gonna, I'm not really feeling the color. There was some other colors. There was like um, some orange colors. There was, all of them were just not calling me as much as this color. I don't know what it is about the green, but also, I actually picked this pumpkin up because I was debating on whether I was going to paint this like a beige color because I do have beige spray paint in my garage. So I was like, you know what? I could just spray paint them. There was some beige pumpkins at Target, but they were very expensive. I think they were like $15 and they were like this size, but they were like more aesthetic and they were more like beige and off beige. And I really was going to get them, but I'm like, pay $15 when I can just like get these for $5 and then I already have paint at home. So I'm still debating if I'm going to keep it this color, but I love it. You guys, I love these like little pumpkins. I want to just put little pumpkins here and there around the house. I'm not going to go like too crazy with decor when it comes to fall. I say that now and then I'm shopping for fall stuff. So, But this is one pumpkin that I picked up. I also picked up this cute little Hello Fall sign, you guys. I don't know if I'm just excited for fall and the fact that it's already here, but I love this little house like fall decor. I really don't know where exactly I'm going to place it in my house. I was debating like somewhere near like my TV in the living room with like a pumpkin. Um, I was also debating if whether like I might put it like somewhere in my backdrop or I'm just debating like I don't really know what I'm going to use it for. They had so many colors. They had a black one like this. Um, they had this color. Uh, they just had so many fall decor. I'm going to also leave a little bit of clips here for you guys so you guys can see what I saw at my Target. But I picked up this because why not? Hello fall. We are here. And then I also picked up this pumpkin shortbread candle. This one was $10. To be really honest, you guys, like, I love me some candles. I do love fall candles, but I'm, I'll am i be honest, I'm not really into like the fall smell, like the cinnamon, pumpkin, and, and have that smell like your whole house. Like, I don't know if I'm crazy, like I'm over here screaming I love fall, but I just don't know if I love that. I love more like scented, like fragrances, like more masculine, I guess you could say, when it comes to like my like my house. So I, I don't know if I'm gonna like this or not, but I picked it up just because of the pretty like, you know, it has like that pretty fall color vibe here. I could put it in my living room. I maybe will light it, maybe in like during the holidays or something, but I don't know. I'm, I'm still debating, but I actually do like the candle like display, like the actual like color. So we'll see, but I picked up one of these and then I also picked up this cute, <laughs> this is such a tiny little pumpkin, but I'm gonna tell you guys why I got it. So I picked up this cute, tiny little pumpkin, you guys. This one was only a dollar. And I was like, oh my god, I, I, at first I was like, why would I anybody buy like a small little pumpkin like that? So when I saw it, I was like, oh, that's cute. And I put it right back. But then when I was walking around, I actually saw this board there for like $5. I got this board and for some reason, something just screamed to me. This will be a perfect little display for fall right next to your Keurig. So I'll go ahead and I'll put a picture right here of how I'm gonna set it up down near, like near my actual like Nespresso. But what I did when I was at the store is I placed it like right against a wall <laughs> and I put the pumpkin there and then I saw this cute little candle. It doesn't say fall on it, but it says home sweet home. So it's, you know, so it's homey. And then I was like, okay, that looks cute. Like, okay, let's, let's see what else they have. So then I walked around and I saw this cute little sign I loved it. It says, but I think I love fall most of all. And then behind it, it actually had get it while it's hot, which is a cute sign too. Like I'm like, okay, which color would I use? But I think what I'm going to do is end up doing it just like this. And it just makes it 
hum all together and it screams fall to me. So I picked all this up. You guys, this right here was like right, right around $10. I'm not even kidding. You really just kind of put your imagination and what you're gonna do with your like decor with your house you know you don't really have to spend so much money I don't plan on spending a lot on fall decor because this is our first year in this house in the holidays and I really kind of want to go in on like Halloween outside and inside and kind of like Christmas too like especially Christmas like I'm putting up my Christmas tree like probably the day of Thanksgiving I'm just kidding but I, I just kind of want to go in more on those holidays and I feel like I just want to add little things of fall around the house but I picked up these I'm really excited and I also picked up these right here I liked it. it it doesn't really say nothing as far as fall but my kitchen colors are kind of like wood black like more around those colors so I saw this also at in the dollar section this one was for five dollars I got this right here I felt like this kind of like showed a little bit of like fall and the fact that it's like has the colors that my kitchen is I kind of was like you know what I'm just gonna put them right on like my stove and just make it look a little bit more put together so I got this okay guys so at my target they actually already had fall and some Halloween mixed together and I am all here for that I ended up picking up these cute, and I don't even know why I picked these up. I think I just liked the fact that they were just Halloween themed, but you never know when you have to give somebody something. So I picked up this You've Been Boozed wine bags, you guys, these right here. But these right here, you guys, I picked up, they were a dollar each. I think this would be like the perfect like gift for like if you're going to like a Halloween party and you get you know you get invited you know a little gift for you know thank you for inviting me or something I just thought they were really cute and I know I'll eventually like use them so I picked up only two because there was only two left but I thought these were so cute I I'm so ready for Halloween you guys like I love fall but I love Halloween I, that's just my thing I don't know what it is but I love Halloween <laughs> I actually bought these they are little treat bags for Halloween. Um, basically, what I'm going, there's like a pack of three, so there's three in each one. So I bought one, two, three, so there's a total of nine. So my family and I kind of go in a little bit on Halloween and hopefully this year in my mom's neighborhood, we're able to like really get like into the spirit because they have canceled trick-or-treating there for over two years already and it's really sad so we're hoping that that we are going to be able to like actually have a Halloween party and do everything so these are little bags that I want to kind of put together for like the kids and stuff and put like little knickknacks in there and little prizes and you know just kind of make it fun um, it's just been a minute since we've been able to do that so I bought these and then I also picked this up you guys tell me this isn't the cutest thing like this is actually battery operated so it's like two AA AA batteries and I actually got this because I have been in 2020 I don't know if you guys have been here that long on my channel but if you haven't I typically try to make content on my channel doing like you know Halloween costumes I did a few in 2020 I think I did two I think it was I think I did La Llorona and then I also did um, a fortune teller like a demented fortune teller um, those are like my two videos that I did here and I actually had a lot of ideas for last year I was supposed to like really go in last year but we had a lot going on we were moving here we had things to do so it just didn't happen I plan on making some Halloween videos and I kind of needed something like in the back. I do want to go back and get a few more things that I saw there, but I also picked up this too, you guys. Like how cute. I need to stop. I'm, I'm acting like a kid right now. This was actually $5 and this one was $5 too. I actually want to put both of these like on my backdrop. I don't really know what type of backdrop I'm, do I'm doing yet. I actually have an idea. I just have to go to like a fabric store and I also have to go to, I also have to order some things on Amazon to do like the spooky backdrop that I'm trying to do. I'm hoping this time around I can like get to it. I'm going to get to it. <laughs> yeah, I got these just to kind of start on the Halloween theme and I also want to like place them around my house have some ideas so that is what I have right there so far you guys with my decor as far as fall and my actual like Halloween ideas 
But now I am actually gonna show you guys some things that I picked up from Target. So I picked up this mug also. I picked it up because for one, I have a black one just like this, but it's actually a little bit shorter. And that mug has been like with us for over a year now. It has never leaked on me. It has been very like sturdy. It's just a really good mug and the seal on it is what got me like so most of the time I don't know if you guys notice this with some mugs but most of the time when you keep using these types of um, tops to your coffee mugs they kind of get like loose and then you start getting like leakage these have not done that to me so when I saw that they had these colors I had to pick it up and this actually retails for I believe five dollars so these are really good mugs I highly suggest and they do keep my coffee pretty warm in the morning so I'm all for that. And then the fact that it's maroon, I feel like it was very fall. So I had to pick up one of these. And then another thing you guys that I picked up that I've already been using for like a while, I wanna say already like maybe three weeks because I am always at Target, is this phone stand right here, you guys. I, I actually have this phone stand right here that I showed you guys on Amazon, on one of my Amazon hauls. This has been my favorite phone stand, but let me tell you why this one now is my favorite. I still keep that one around. But this one right here, it has a little ring light that you just, it comes with a charger too. And you kind of just turn it on. And it has bright, another setting, and another setting. So like if you do like reels or if you're like, you know, on TikTok and you're doing TikTok videos or something, which I feel like a lot of people are, <laughs> I feel like this is like the perfect stand for you. I use it so much. I'm always using it when I have like Zoom calls and you know, I want to be like bright in my face just because that way people can like see me so it doesn't look so dark. It actually moves around, which is nice because I've been doing little videos on reels, no, on TikTok. I haven't posted them yet, but I've been practicing how to like film on my phone. And this has been really handy. I've been able to place my phone and kind of like record from it and like put my phone in angles. So if you're looking for something like that, I really suggest one of these. I think this one retailed for $5 at Target. I was there earlier today and I did see that they still have them. Please go and check that out because they have a lot of them. Some of them were broken, so you gotta kind of make sure that you don't get the ones that are broken. But it has worked for me. It does the job and, and I absolutely love it. Another thing that I picked up is this moisture conditioner from Monday. I actually picked up the shampoo too but I needed to use it. <laughs> so I'm not gonna show it on the video, but I do have the shampoo and the conditioner. I love this shampoo, you guys. I started using the Native conditioner and I believe it was the moisture one. And to be really honest with you guys, that one really kind of made my hair very greasy. Um, I love the smell of it. It did have like a coconut smell to it, but I just didn't like how it made my hair look after like two days of not washing it because I don't wash my hair every single day. I normally wash my hair like every three to four days if I can get away with it. But I picked up this one because I love this one. It has given me so much moisture. I also love it because it smells so good. Like I feel like my hair smells like this for like two days straight, you guys. Like I love it. I really hope that they come out with more like different things i hope they come out with like a maybe a maybe a hairspray that kind of smells like this it's just uh, such a good smell like i wish you guys can smell it but it just has like a really good like salon smell it reminds me a lot of like this um shampoo that my mom used to buy me when i was little um it was like a pantene one i don't know it was a um, paul mitchell shampoo that I used to use a lot when I was little because I used to get my hair permed when I was like 10. Yeah, Curly Sue. I used to like damage my hair at that age. I was crazy. I can't believe my mom let me like get a perm at 10, but it was the thing back in the day. So <laughs> anyways, the Paul Mitchell was always like something that was in our shower. When I smelled this, it just gave me like a flashback of like me using that Paul Mitchell shampoo. So I picked this up and I absolutely love it. And then I also picked up these lashes right here. These ones are the Kiss Lashes in the style 11. Let me show you guys right here. Yes. I love these lashes. I think I, I purchased these lashes for two reasons. So lately I have been doing like my own lash application, like my own lash extensions. I've been using the Kiss wand and what I do is I cut these in three 
and I place them like right under my eyes and then I seal it and then I bond it. They normally last me like about four to five days depending if I'm not sleeping on my face and they don't smash all over my eyes, but they really do work. I don't really use the Kiss, like the Kiss lashes that come with those lash extensions. Those ones just don't give me no like volume or any type of like look. They just don't even look like I have it lashes on. So I saw a girl on TikTok use these to place instead of using the others from Kiss and I actually really like this one better. They look like lash extensions. They look so good, especially if you're a person who works, you know, every single day of the week or you're a mom and you're busy, you don't have time all the time to be putting on lashes but you wanna look put together. I highly recommend doing those. I do it every Sunday and then it lasts me up until Wednesday and then Thursday, Friday. Like I'll either add lashes or just curl my lashes but I love these. And this is the whole reason why I bought them. The last thing I have is something that I already kind of unpacked. It had like a little cover on it, but we opened it up. We got this in the workout section, you guys, at Target. And it was actually in the clearance area for the workout section. And I, me and my son do this like when me and him are working out together, like in the garage or something. So it's just a little dice roll. So on one side it says 10 leg raises, um, 10 sumo squats, 10 mountain climbers, 30 arm circles, 10 leg raises, and then it just has like water break. It just kind of is a really good activity, like if you have like your son or a family member and you guys are working out together. I feel like this is just so much fun. Like me and my son love to do this together. We'll even do it in my room where we'll just kind of put music on and just kind of roll the dice and we'll kind of just do it together. And it's a really good activity. We do it for like 30 minutes when we get a chance in, during the week. We absolutely love it and we've been using it a lot. So if you guys see this at Target, I highly recommend because it's super cool and it's very engaging and we love it. But all right guys, that is it. That is it for my Target haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this little Target fall haul slash Target haul. I don't know what I'm gonna call this video, but I really do hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, don't walk to your Target. I suggest you guys run to your Target and start picking up all these like cute little like fall things and fall pieces because I feel like everybody is going to start getting them. Like I tell you not, people are going to start shopping for all this fall stuff and I don't want my people to be late in the game so please go to your local Target and pick up all these cute fall decors and these Halloween decors. I feel like it's a reasonable price right now especially like that little front area at Target so I definitely suggest going to Target and picking this up. But yeah guys I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so every time I upload a video you guys are notified and i will see you guys on the next video very soon Mwah. bye guys